For this exercise, we'll perform a normal loaded hip thrust, but on the last rep, you'll hold at the top of the thrust for some period of time. So you'll see how many reps you should be doing and then how long you'll hold at the top on that final repetition. So we'll need that stable elevated surface to position just below our shoulder blades to help us have that elevated upper body. Position the barbell or a dumbbell on top of your hip or you can have a plate on your thighs. We know at the top of the position we wanna have a 90 degree bend through our knee with our feet and knees both parallel hip width apart. So I like to come up here first, get into position, and then lower down, and then I'm gonna start my first repetition. So we'll lift up, squeeze your glutes, and perform the exercise just like this, gazing forward. When you get to your final rep, you're gonna come up and hold at the top. Important here that we're not arching our back. We've got our rib cage pressing down. We're squeezing our glutes, filling it in our glutes and hamstrings and you'll just hold that last rep and then come on down.